Okay, so my cell phone holder does not want to hold up anymore. So I have got it supported on the side. <laughs> so um, this is Tracy Bowman, Bowman for Art on Facebook. And I'm gonna do a big blue flower. I've done two. I'm gonna do another one. <clears throat> so I'm liking that. And this is green oxide. And it's from, who is it by? Amsterdam. Troubled. Not to worry. Okay. A little extra color in the leaves. This is um, Shocking Green by Arteza. This is 24 karat gold by Deco Art. The blue color I put down is um, um, Deco Art's Metallics Blue Ice. And here is my cell activator which is Amsterdam's sap green, and I added a little bit of Payne's gray to it to darken it up some, so I have a nice rich color. We want good contrast. And now I'm gonna add a little extra cell activator, which is bluish green. Gives uh, an interesting hue to the leaves. I've been enjoying that. All right, we'll blow those out. Coming from up high, catching that bullseye there, blowing it out. We'll let that settle. I'm gonna blow a little bit here. A couple little spots I wanted to open up a little bit. All right. <clears throat> so I'm gonna get some more blue. And I added some, um, maybe a touch more. I added some Chantilly Lace by Prism Pour. And it's called Chantilly Lace. It just gives the paint uh, some extra bling, which I love the bling. So I'm gonna give a spot of white. Just to soften the color some. I'm gonna give a tiny bit of green. I 
and some gold. <clears throat> All right, now I'm going to do some a little bit of white cell activator. It's three drops. I'm going to do a few drops of the green. And then I have bluish green. All my cell activators are Arteza. No, sorry, Amsterdam. All my <laughs> cell activators are made with Amsterdam pink. You can use any color you want. And I'm coming from up high with my blower, catching right on that bullseye, blowing it out. alone tracing all right so let me get you a little bit closer so you can see what I see so it blew out nicely now that cell activator has to come together and you'll see in the end that it does it's stretching the consistency so and you can see how the leaves have done very well Selled up really nicely. So I'm going to give that an extra moment. <clears throat> and I think that this moment is important to let that collect itself. Just like the leaves had the opportunity to, to do. So I'm going to give that another moment on its own. It came out lovely. And it's great how it's already gone over the edge organically. That's because I had plenty of paint on the canvas. All right, I think we can give it a little bit of a spin right now. flower has grown nicely and it's still working there so we'll leave that alone for a few minutes maybe I'll play with the leaves So it's collected itself really well now. You can see there's not a big spot in the center. And uh, we can work on our petals. And I love this skewer. It has a fat end and a skinny end that help me do different things. So I use the fat end to do the petals. And I clean my skewer off each time.
Now I'm gonna detail the petals with the skinny end. And I just bring a little spot out. And we're giving it a spin. Nice big flower. Beautiful. All right. Now we need some doodad, doodad flowers. A good size one there. Just a little drop with my other kind of skewer. This one's a regular skinny one. And I use the flat end to make my little doodad flowers. I just dip in the paint. And doodad flowers need leaves too, so I'm just gonna give little drops here for leaves. I'm going to dip the pointy end in my gold paint and I'm going to draw right through the little dots. They create these little heart shaped flowers, which are just adorable. Just giving the flowers a little extra accent. Oh, I love them. Really nice. It came out really nice. All right. Let me get you here for a close up. And there we go. There is the painting as a whole. I don't know if you're upside down or right side up. I can't tell. <laughs> I hope you're doing right. Little doodad flowers. The center of this flower is really lovely. As you can see, came out lovely. And the other doodad flower there, my leave accents. So I hope you liked that video. If you would like and subscribe, that would be great. I'd appreciate it. Share your free to ask questions and I'll try and help. All right, thanks a lot. Happy painting. Bye now.